Hey guys. We're the best here. And we're playing some faster than light. This is just a test video to um, determine sound levels and resolution error correcting and stupid shit like that because for some reason this game doesn't want to display in like 1080p so we're just gonna have to kind of do what we can. So I I'm gonna outright say that I have played this game before um, back when it first came out uh, and even then it was only briefly so I do have a feel for the mechanics of the game and I don't want to say the flow of the game but just basically uh, things and uh, by now you're probably telling me to just get on the fucking game so and then I will uh, explain further so I have recently just downloaded this one we'll start a new game you can choose your ship I can't can't choose any other ones because because I'm shit. Yeah, it's a unique quest and finish the game and things like that, and you get different like loadouts as well. Not loadouts, but different layouts. Right. Okay, I have to choose this one. That's fine. I can't choose any of them. High dreams. Why would I do that? Just so you can see the outside. And it gives you the uh, requirements, and you can rename your dudes. So I'm gonna be. Wait, and then I don't think I have a woman, but whatever, it's fine. Gonna name it Blue Cool, Blue Cool 10. And I'm gonna name this one Spencer Bedlam. There we go. And we start with an Artemis missile and a birth laser mark. So basically it's kind of like a roguelike, we'll do easy mode because uh, I'm terrible at the game. Advanced edition content? Why not? Why not? So we'll just start here. The data you carry is vital to the remaining Federation fleet and supplies for the journey so make sure to explore your section before moving on to the next. But get to the exit before pursuing rebel fleet can catch up. Upgrades? Don't forget to upgrade your ship. Often shields are the highest priority if you don't want to be useful in this system. So we're just going to press space to unpause our faster than light uh, warp drive is ret to go weapons are not online so we will divert power from shields to that i think can i how do i ah I have to use... Oh no, this is the spare. This is the spare power that we've got on the left. And then, okay, so thrusters... Dodge 10. And we're gonna put... Oh no, okay, that is a spare one, that's fine. So we're gonna right click and take one off of that and that one so we can charge our burst laser as well. And we're gonna wait for that to charge up so that if we encounter anyone, we can wreck stuff. Uh, these are the doors, close the doors in the ship, open all doors, and other stuff like that. So we need a, a guy on the helm, we need a guy in the engines to, yeah, do stuff. So we're going to go to, hmm, there's nebulae there, which is bad. So we're going to go here. Oh no, it's an asteroid field. Prepare for a fight. And you press space to pause it, because I've no idea what I'm doing. Oh no, you have to wait for your weapons to, to charge for some reason. And your flash and light drive uh, charges as well. This is really, this is like a really bad one, actually, to start off with. So we'll do an Artemis on his shields. And then we'll do a burst laser on him. So I need to get this sucker in here to fix the O2. Oh yeah, and then when you destroy your... Oh no, because then it automatically attacks afterwards. So my oxygen is running out, as you can see, and all my guys are going to suffocate to death. 
uh, a ship explodes, the demon behind sustains a collection of useless scrap material. So as your ship gets damaged, um, certain systems in the ship uh, no longer function because they're destroyed. So I'll need to get my dude in here somehow. How do I get my dude in there? Get in there. Get, can I? Yeah. Fix it. And you see their health bars. Do do do, and then you can get back on the engine, and he can fix that one. And you can get in there and fix that bedlam. That's a bit of a bit of an awkward place to do it. Because then your health rapidly depletes after that. And then if he dies, you just send him to the med bay to get healed up. Oh no. That's fixed now. Okay, so that all the oxygen in that room is going to recover rapidly. Which is fine. Bedlam can get back on weapons. Luko can get back on shields. And I've got drone parts, missiles, fuel. It's fine. Oh, key return. Okay, return. No returns. Yeah. Hotkey, this one. There we go. Right, let's jump. There's a bit of faffing about. Upon complete your jump, you receive a message from a nearby ship. Greetings and welcome to our beacon. For a small fee, you will continue on your way. Either home or tell them to fuck off. I think we will tell them to fuck off because scrap is precious to us. Too bad, you will regret this decision. So they've got drones as well, which is kind of bad, but it's fine. We're going to wait for our lasers to recharge. And that'll be it. We'll just kind of hope to not get... screwed by the laser. Right, what, what do we want? Shields. Right, and as soon as that's down, I want... Is that hacking? Yeah. I want their hacking to go down as well. Ah, and then sometimes if they're in danger of being killed, like their health is here, um, they'll sometimes surrender and be like, no, can you um, not kill us please? And I will actually accept their offer because I don't want further damage to my ship. Like, we could have taken them out because they, they only have like a laser thing, so it's not a big deal. But you can get in there and fix that, so can you. And then this tells you what, what you need to be able to jump properly. Right, back to stations, and that's enter, isn't it? Yeah, so I've got me on the helm, yeah, and then I've got Bedlam on the weapons, which is cool. Jump to, uh oh, and then you see here is this impending wave of ass wrecking the ships. <coughs> and then long range scanners lets us say what, what's there, what's like in the next area, really. Unvisited posh uh, okay. I forget how we upgrade to get more power and so forth. Most supplies, uh, improve my reactor. Oh, two missiles, uh, I don't really have need for drone parts, so yeah, why not. Upgrade the reactor by one. Continue. So that's increased our reactor thing here, and that's allowed us to have all of our um, functions fully functional. Uh, store. Oh dear. Want to do that? Or do I? Because then that can go there, that can go there, and then we can pop up there. 
which is fine. No, 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 no. No. Let's go to the store, just so I can see. What you buy? Drone control. System repair drone. Backup battery. Hacking. And you've got, you can buy fuel, which we may need to do at some point, missiles, drone parts, or you can fix things because our, our health doesn't get fixed. Anti-personal drone, but we need a drone. I thought we had a, needed a drone, but yeah, we need a drone system to do that. Or shield. We need a drone system. Yeah, these are all like, very much drone, drone parts. So yeah, we need a drone, drone control. Hmm. Page two though, and then we can get different, we can like hire a crew, or we can get more weapons, firebomb, that's really good actually. Tempted to get an ion blast and then one of these dudes, an MG, and then try and fix like our thing slightly. And we can sell things as well, but I'm not interested in that at the moment. Can I rearrange? Oh, I can rearrange. But then, how does it? Ah. Ah, okay. I can do that. So what I can do is I can maybe strategically, um, strategically save missiles and by disabling their shields with an ion blast and then burst lasering their shields and then not letting me get through uh, like their defenses, basically. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go this way. This one. Possible ship detected. It's gonna wait for our inevitable demise. You can't rename a uh, new crew though, which is a bit shame. Uh, a bit of shame. Well, I could hand over the a crew member that I just bought, or one of my current crew. But no. Draw straws and such crew member Uh, one of our surrender. Uh oh. Damn it, I have to wait for my stuff to charge up, don't I? And so to see. Oh, quick. Right, Iron Blast. On his shields. And then, Burst Laser. On his weapons, because that really hurt. There we go, his weapons are offline. And then I'll try and ion blast them again. to vent the, vent the flames, ion blast on his engine, and then burst laser on his weapons again. Oh, I can get a rock man. Yeah, let's have a rock man. 
Thank you for your patronage. I'd have preferred scrap so I can heal up my... Oh, do I go there though? I'll go to you. We'll soon find out. You yeah, arrived at the stress beacon near a small asteroid belt and find a ship with pirate markings. Potentially crushed between two large rocks. Must have been legally mining the belt without public crop. Shoot the rocks. You take a few careful shots, but you expose the mineral flats in the rock that right, reacts violently with your weapon. A shot that forces you back is to be felt to you against your own. When you regain control, you find there's not much left of the ship. Come on. 14 will be alright. Now I need to get someone in there to fix it. Rockman, what are you doing? Are you on shields or something? NG dude, what are you doing? What are you actually doing? I forget what their type advantages are. I don't know. Uh, you can get on. Well, if I get Rockman on in the O2, that'll be really handy because. And then if I get him in shields. Because if shields go down, I need to fix it ASAP. And then I've got this safe positions, which is cool. So we've got all of our all of our buddies here. I'll get Lukul cool into the med bay just to heal her up. Because why not? Time is not an issue here. Time is not an issue. <coughs> Apologies, I have a bit of a cold. Right, now we're gonna go to this one, which is a bit a bit of a pain because I hate nebulae because there's all sorts of nasty stuff that can happen here, like ion storms and stuff. You notice a mantis attack ships uh, ducking between the clouds of swirling space stuff. It's something you try to get a jump and attack. He's got big cannons, so I take it we're going to get wrecked by some of his guns here. So what we'll do is we'll do the same as before. Oh no! The missile, no! My iron blast. Oof. Right, as soon as that hits, and then do the weapons, do the weapons, do the weapons. Oof. That's a good one. It's okay though, it's okay. Last on the go again. So I can get the burst laser into the weapons. Now he's dead. Yes. 18 scrap. I could use a bit of fuel though. But it's fine. Get Lucy in the, the freaking thing there. There we go. Get back to your station. Jump. And now we need to go to the exit. Because otherwise I'm going to get wrecked by the uh, impending fleet. I can jump! Yay! Exit. Next sector. And then... That's the end. I'll go to... Uncharted Nebula. I have to navigate on instinct. Oh, I can. I'll cut the video here, and I'll be right back. Thanks for watching, guys.